Keep it up, one more minute Keep it up, you're so great Standing, talking You got me checkmate No one's watching or nothing Hey everybody, today I'm gonna try to do a bloom swipe. And I have my cake spinner, I have my, this is a 12 by 18 inch canvas maybe? I don't know, 12 by 20. Um, but I have my colors and I have some TLP sea glass and you can kind of see how that looks and TLP Mermaid. It's such a pretty color. And this is Pearl, Pearl X Magenta mixed with some polypore. But it still looks very pretty. And this is Matisse. I think it's a cobalt blue, but it's Matisse. These colors are very rich and very pigmented. And I have two cell activators. The first cell activator is Atelier Rich Gold. And mixed with Aussie Floetrol and Black Oxide mixed with Aussie Flow Troll. We're just gonna play around and see what I can get with these. Um, so yeah, so I'm just gonna put it down and I may try to do something that I would call a uh, transfer shift <laughs> with the initial bloom after I swipe it. Um, and you'll see what I mean when I get that far. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my colors down My sea glass. Love that color, so pretty. Very pretty color. And mermaid also very pretty. And the magenta pearl X. Hmm. These look very pretty. I love that sea glass color. And I am going to swipe the back of my spatula, my cake server, with my cell activator. And I think I'm going to do it like this. some gold see what we get okay so you can kind of see what that looks like and let's see ok 
Okay, I'm liking that. Ooh. Okay. Well, it's kind of beautiful. And now I'm going to swipe on this side, also with some black, but maybe more gold this time. Just to see what kind of effect we get. Okay. Beautiful. Well, that looks beautiful. I'm gonna let that sit for a second and get my colors out of the way because I don't want to be spinning this thing. He's sitting here. Okay. Pop some bubbles that I got with my skewer. But I am loving the cells that I'm seeing down through here. They're beautiful. Let's see, I'm gonna spin it a little bit, see. Now, I am going to play with this now. Like what I was talking about earlier, I've got some really cool cells through there that I love. Um, but I'm going to see if we can get up underneath some of this. Yeah, and bring it on out. I'll feather it. Maybe close you up on some of this.
Okay. Alright, I'm liking that. If I can get up underneath this. Now, if you're enjoying this video and found it interesting, entertaining, and informative, please like the video, give me the thumbs up, and subscribe to my channel, and when you do, ring the bell so you'll be alerted when I upload new videos, and share the video. If you, think of, if you know of someone who might be interested in this kind of transfer uh, shifting from a uh, bloom swipe, share the video. Okay. Hmm. I'll do a little more to this area. <clears throat> cool. Let's see. I may spin this a little bit one more time. Then I might say like I'm done. I kind of like how simplified this is, but there's beautiful cells in it. Interesting to look at.
Now my base is the PPG eggshell um, that Karen Dershon suggested. Um, and I did another bloom that way and it turned out really, really nice. So I decided, hey, why not try it with a bloom swipe? And I think this turns out pretty cool. I'm trying to touch up my edges and get the uh, paint off the sides. But there's some really beautiful things happening there with the cells. So, I think I'm gonna take you down and we're gonna call this done. This is a cool way, I think, to do a swipe and then to create shapes once you've got your initial swipe down. I'm getting some kind of interesting, almost pearl-like shapes and things going on. I wanna use my dowel. Yep, that's looking pretty good. There's some cool stuff going on through here that almost looks like a spinal column. That's really, really cool through the center. So let's take you down and have you look. I think that Atelier Gold mixed with the black does some cool things too. Okay, now we're gonna go in and look. I don't know if you can see how shimmery this is, but it's gorgeous. All that lacing and then how I did the transfer shift underneath the image to kind of get these other shapes and then move my dowel through it with some loop-de-loops. That's really Beautiful, I love how wispy that is. And this is the section that looks like a spinal column. That's pretty cool, it looks like vertebrae. <laughs> really cool. And that Pearl X magenta seemed to play well with the sea glass and the mermaid. And then the Matisse blue is very rich and deep. I love that too, that almost looks like a butterfly wing there but yeah so that's it that's my swipe with a little bit of transfer shifting going on I hope you guys enjoyed that had as much fun as I did now Julie E from acrylic painting with Julie E was before me at 6 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and after me will be Angie Mason fluid art at 7 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and after Angie will be K&K &K Create at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Be sure and check everybody's videos out. Well, I hope you enjoyed this bloom swipe with some transfer shifting and I will have another video in my series of fluid art seascapes coming up on large scale canvases that I'm doing for my commission so be on the lookout for that and as always thank you for watching. I look forward to meeting you again for some more fun pouring together.